Tutto Sport in Italy reporting that Harry Kane could be heading to Juventus. Dybala going the other way, Jules. Any chance that this could actually happen? I think this one is a really, really, really long shot. Not, not because Juventus you know, might be interested in, in, in Harry Kane. I think a lot of big clubs will be if he makes himself available. Let's not forget he's got a very, very long-term contract as Spurs and it will cost a lot of money to whoever would want to sign him. But more because Juventus have put a lot of money into Cristiano Ronaldo, uh, of course, that is costing them already a lot of money. They've got a huge squads with a huge wage bill as well. And I just don't think right now they have the money to spend on Harry Kane, uh, let alone, you know, if they really want him and if he wants to go there. However, I'm sure if you're Harry Kane right now and seeing how Spurs are going with Mourinho at the helm, you may be pondering what your future could be because he will come back from injury at some point very soon. He doesn't need to rush anything anymore because there's no Euros to play for in the summer. So he can take his time and then maybe assess the situation and decide of what he wants to do. He loves that club. That's his club. That's where he feels at home, obviously. But there's also maybe a direction that he's not so keen on that yeah. towards, towards what the club is going right now. And this is it, Ian, isn't it? You take a look at what Spurs have done over the last few months over Jose Mourinho. And if you're Harry Kane and you're watching this all play out, Surely, for the first time, you're having doubts about your future and maybe having a word with your agent to have a word with the likes of Real Madrid, who apparently are interested. Well, I, I don't know what Harry Kane's private thoughts about the situation are, but I know there'd be a riot among the, the Tottenham fans, and Tottenham would have to factor that into any possible move away uh, from uh, North London for him. I think there is another factor to this, though, and Tottenham might look at the situation and say, yeah, Things have got a bit stale. We do need major surgery. Obviously, Daniel Levy, um, who seems to have the hold on the purse strings there, isn't that keen on big buys, but he could free up a lot of money mm. by taking this big decision to sell up Kane to finance that rebuild. That would be a possibility, but I think a lot would depend on Harry Kane's view of things, whether he really wants to stay or whether he thinks maybe, yeah, it is time for a change now. I don't think it'd be to Juventus. I don't think really Serie A would appeal to him, but Spain might. If you're Harry Kane, you went out, do you? Now's the time. Well, unfortunately for him, he signed a long-term deal, and, mm. and Daniel Levy's not a guy who's going to bend for anybody. That's that, that. To me, I just don't see how Harry Kane, whether he wants to go or not, is going. You can expect a lot of transfer talk, of course, over the next few weeks. We will be keeping you up to date with all the latest of them. Uh, be sure to check out Transfer Talk over on the ESPN FC website. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.